Hodge Productions presents Pouring Ale. Oh, for in fuck's sake, we'll start again. Hodge Productions presents Pouring Ale in a Glass. Mm. Enjoy. Mm. There I'm trying Hobgoblin <laughs> Session <laughs> IPA. Bollocks! That's it, tastes like uh, grapefruit. She's your wife. This one was actually, I think, a birthday day present. She said, well, get what you want. I said, well, I want this one or Christmas. I think it was actually Christmas box. Because like, there's like eight, all eight films in this Blu-ray box set. But at some point, I am one to downsize my The Sweeney. Mm. Well, look at the problems we had when we were watching The Sweeney. Um, I'm going to play, I'm going, well I've got an interview with Brian, um, Brian Blessed or um, Warren Mitchell. I realise now I could do out all that trimmings, you know, like, like uh, cut the fat so to speak. Straight in the episode, that's it. Yeah, like, I mean, the one we get is we read Dwarf. Because there's some of the extras are brilliant, the documentaries and the outtakes. Right, so let's try Mango IPA by Kirk. Kirkstall. This is my opinion of Kirkstall's Mango IPA. Well, that's tippant. Oh, my God. This is Mango IPA. Mm. What do you think? So like what you wash you wash dishes in. <laughs> I don't think so. It's no, it's uh, it's nice on the last one. It one, one sips enough. It's it's nice on the last one, but like I say, this one by Kirkso Brewery doesn't have that fruit. Oh, and there's a beer. So that's probably another one I won't bother with. The rhubarb and custard by Northern Monk is fucking beautiful. That one you first tried with the orange slice on it, the judicious. That one nice. This is this this is another one which I probably won't bother with because it's I don't get that fruit. Mmm, and there's the beer. Did you say the same about um neck oil? So, you got oh yes, that tastes like grape and grapefruit and passion fruit, and then yeah, mango and the the ah, Yeah, I mean this one's better than the last one, but there's no <clears throat> ah, there's the beer. So that Tulkan Tropic eh, eh, mango IPA, eh, eh. but the the first one and the rhubarb and custard. They're the are definite winners. So if I go through the other ones that that's on offer at the scope up as there, and I can narrow it down, and I I probably say I get two rhubarb and custard, and two uh, uh, judicious because they're absolutely lovely. Oh. I think rhubarb and custard is my favourite. Singing like that makes me 
think I should go solo. I mean, if he can do it. Yeah. And I honestly believe I've got something. Oh, that so as is Stedman then. Fuck me. Would want to hear. Yeah, well, I know you come to mention it. You have got a touch of the Susan Boyles about you. Oh, please don't. Congratulations, you two. Yeah, lovely service. Yeah, I'll be some of the food. Cheers, Pam. Good on you. And there's a bar over there, so order whatever you like. They bring it over to you. Oh, very generous. Hey, you can have anything. Beers, wine, vodka, rum. Just tell him what you want and he'll do it for you. And then just pay him with a tell. It's not a thing. Congratulations, you two. I hope you're very Cheers, Pam. Let's take a look at Two birds with one stone, like I'm making a christening slash engagement party. Whoa, hang on, what's this about a slash? I don't want a slash. No one told me I was having a slash. Oh, god, that is like the bum custard. The mullet this sweet. No, rather the pudding. Oh, god, that's, that's one.